Hey guys, we watched the How to Train Your Dragon trilogy. If you guys want us to watch more movies, suggest them down in the comment section below, and you can watch the full commentary on our Patreon, linked at the top of the description, and subscribe so you don't miss the next video. This video is sponsored by Bad Dragon. That would be incredible. Seriously. That would be literally Seriously. be the perfect sponsor. We're five seconds into the movie, and you're already talking about giant dick. Why they call him toothless though? The head is crazy. Dude, I didn't know they called him toothless because I've never seen this movie. So how can you shut up and let me watch the movie? Okay, I don't want to spoil you on much, but I will spoil you. That is a key factor in how they become friends. Most people would leave. Not us. We're Vikings. We're Vikings. We rip and pillage. My name's Hiccup. I'm Hiccup. I'm the one Viking who doesn't rip and pillage. I'm the first one of my kind. After I watched this movie for the first time in a while, I looked up, I was like, are Vikings really that bad? And I found a story about how one guy got basically got called a put because he didn't want to participate in a Vikings game of tossing children in the air and catching them on the end of a spear. That's like a visceral human experience that we miss out on in modern society. Like, I want to be able to, like, go throw a kid on a spear. Like, what's stopping me? What have we got? Grunkles, nuthers, simple box, oh, and horks are monstrous. What weirds me out about this movie is that, like, Hiccup's dad has, like, a Scottish accent. But, like, Jay Baruchel, who is a Canadian actor, has, like, the most generic-ass <laughs> American voice. We move to the lower defenses. We'll counter-attack with the catapults. We'll counter I, I love Viking accents. They're, like, the most satisfying accents. I love Viking accents. I love the Vikings' actions. Oh, the actions. <laughs> the twins, rough nut and tough nut. And... Guys, I found the romantic interest. Gia baddie baddie for real, for real. This might be the romantic interest, guys. I'm not completely sure. He did emphasize the ass. Astrid. Bro, that sounded like a Roblox sound effect right there. <laughs> that, sound, that sounded like the Tim on. <laughs> because killing a dragon is everything around here. It, it's really brave of uh, DreamWorks to name this movie How to Kill a Dragon. <laughs> like, it's teaching children, like, a valuable asset of killing something, which... We all have to do one day. Mm -hmm. So are the dragons supposed to be like the American government and like the Vikings are supposed to be like innocent Afghani people? Like, what is this about exactly? The Vikings are the drone strikes. That's kind of what it seems like. I mean, they're literally going into people's houses and killing them. How to drone strike a hospital. How to train an Iraqi, dude. Think about it. Oh, I hit it. He snagged one. Is that the toothless one? No, this is the toothless one. That's the toothful one. It's an ironic name, though. That's toothless because he has he's toothful, but like it's kind of like ironic. You know, sometimes a little bit of teeth isn't so bad. No, I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know about that one. I usually get behind most things you say, but maybe not this. You know all that. This movie is so ugly. I'm sorry. This movie is fucking awful to look at after like watching Kung Fu Panda. Is it that ugly? I think it's kind of mid. Nah, this movie's ugly as hell. I'm so tired of it already. Wow. Okay. Just stop. Oh yeah, this movie is ugly. Yeah, because now the sun's coming up, so now you can see how ugly all the characters look. It literally looks like a Wii version. <laughs> a Wii cutscene. It actually kind of does look like a Wii cutscene. Yeah, how to train your dragon for the Nintendo Wii is what we're watching right now. <laughs> Even as a boy, I knew what I was, what I had to become. Hiccup is not that boy. I almost want to take my headphones off. I hate this movie so far. What? I'm sorry. It's just like, why? Do, just the structure of the movie is like, I'm not invested in the world whatsoever to care about this conversation yet. You know what I mean? I, I want to see what the world is first. What are you talking about? We're, we're, we're just kind of establishing the relationships of the characters. We got the Assassin's Creed over the shoulder. Editor, can you like put quick time events for, for when he kills people here? <sighs> My God, he's a pussy, dude. He's a pussy. It's just a hiccup. It's just a hiccup. He'll kill it later in the movie. Is, is the movie going to end like I named you hiccup because I knew you would hiccup our futures? Uh, uh, he says, uh, he's, he spasms after it. Well, a hiccup is involuntary and unwanted, just like him. The fucking hurdy gurdy, man. The hurdy gurdy. What the fuck does that mean? It's the greatest instrument of all time. Repair you need this. I don't want to fight dragons. He wants to bake bread. Let him cook. Which means you walk like us, you talk like us. No more of. No more of this shitty Canadian accent. Where did you even get this Canadian accent? <laughs> we don't even get trailer park boys out here. I rented the VHSs. Come to dragon training. No turning back. 
She looks so fucking stupid. Yeah. She looks like Sid the Sloth, bro. Can we talk about that? <laughs> These characters look fucked up. They're all like incest babies, so they're all fucked. Hiccup already killed a Night Fury, so does that disqualify him or? Jonah Hill plays a not fat character. Like, what is happening here? Yeah, that is pretty insane. What caused him to make that decision? Dreamworks should be fired for that. He should have played that fat guy, bro. Jonah Hill is only allowed to play fat characters. <laughs> I love watching crippled animals. It's so funny. He's just gonna count how many times he fails, bro. He's just like marking them off. Where he should be. Thank you, Astrid. Dude, I'm just, I don't even know what to say, man. I've heard so many amazing things about this movie, and I'm watching. And I'm just like, I have. Does it get good later? I don't know what you don't like about it. Is it just cause it's ugly? I feel like nothing has happened. There's the dialogue is just so lame. I don't know. All these incest children I gotta look at. Like I don't know, man. I love incest children, so it's the perfect movie for me. Uh, okay, uh, I'll see you uh, tomorrow. 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 Oh, oh my goodness. That's me, Rare bro. That's Canadian me. Moment. They should have killed him on the spot for that, to be honest. What? Why did you pronounce it like take hiccup? Hiccup. Scaldron. Sprays scalding water at its victim. I like how he's reading off these dragon names and they all have like the most generic ass names. This is the Chinese dragon. This is the change wing dragon. It can change its wings. Like you don't need to fucking tell us what it is. It's in the name. How do you think people came up with names for things in the first place? You know what I mean? Bird? It's because birds used to bird all the time. So they're like, that's a bird. You know oh, what I mean? That does actually make sense. That makes that's a lot how, of that's sense. That's where names come from. I know it smells crazy in there, though. I mean, they're Viking. They probably smell crazy. Did Vikings have f skin or did they use that axe to chop it off? I think that's a coming of age this passage like, for them. No, it's fine. How did Strania f skin? What, what were you going <laughs> to say? I'm just like, what the fuck? Where did this come from? That's so like... Well, you're talking about the smell and like, I was thinking, uh, you know, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you ever bathe? Now they're talking about bathing. Yeah, these characters suck. I'm pretty sure they bathe together. That's wholesome. I feel like there's just some siblings you can look at and you're like, they're definitely showering together. You know what I mean? Like, not even in a weird way, just like uh, their family. What do you mean not in a weird way? There's no way. What do you mean not in a weird way? I mean, like, not in like a way but it is weird i don't know maybe the vikings just did it different i'm just saying like <laughs> hypothetically speaking they definitely did do it different is this some kind of a joke to you that skirt goes hard though are those like monkey skulls around the waistline <laughs> what the like what they're is squirrel that? heads don't trust this girl she decapitates animals <laughs> and like she's a fucking serial killer in training Aw, dude, he's so fucking cute. I love him. <laughs> Must buy marketable plushie. Must buy marketable merchandise. I will buy marketable plushie. Oh, no, no, no. Could have sworn you had. <laughs> Damn, he was moaning after he ate that. That, that <laughs> fish must have been good as hell. Damn. <laughs> He's trying to share. It's like when the cat like leaves the corpse of the mouse they caught on your doorstep. But how did he cut it in half inside of his <laughs> own body? He's got a second mouth in his stomach. Mm. Ew, oh, oh, oh my God, oh. That thing must smell so <laughs> fucking bad, man. It's all about bonding. Like you've got to share a meal with your friends. You've got to baby bird your food into your friend's mouth. Is this how you train a dragon? Yeah. Did we just figure it out? All right, end the movie, end the <laughs> video, guys. We figured it out. I will be leaving now. I got what I wanted out of this movie. <laughs> Aw, that's cute. Do you think like this is what white women watch this movie and they're like, I had the same experience with my dog. This movie is actually so real. It is real with a pet, dude. Like, you know, you bond with them. You guys are fucking assholes. <laughs> You get a tattoo? Not a tattoo? Oh my god, she noticed Hiccup is running off because she's attracted to rebels. Realistically speaking, he is like the only person her age in this entire village that isn't horrifyingly hideous. Yeah, but looks aren't everything, okay? Like, it's what's on the inside that counts. And that fat guy, he has a lot inside, you know what I mean? That's true. So, he has a lot of inside. He does eat a lot, a lot of, of a lot. Dude, dude, you could easily put like some like TikTok short music or whatever over this, and it's like when they let him cook, man. When they let him that, cook. <laughs> when they let him cook. His tinkering element of his character is one of my favorite parts. They should have called him Tinker Bro. Like Tinker Bell, Tinker Bro. I'm so glad you're not involved in the entertainment <laughs> industry. Eh, don't you mind me? I'll just back 
Here. I will say, I do finally think this movie is getting good with the relationship. This is the best part. I can understand you thinking the beginning is slow. Yeah. Yeah, once he starts training the dragon is when it gets good. I mean, I guess that kind of makes sense. Whoa. Dude, that's like the Nutcrusher 3000. Can you imagine <laughs> actually being on this thing as a dude? Bro, have you ever been horseback riding before? That shit destroys your ball. I'm never riding a horse now. <laughs> Couldn't you just like wear a cup or something? Probably, but when I went horseback riding when I was like 13, I didn't really get the memo on that. Is that why you sound like that, bro? Yeah, that's what, yeah. It's kind of <laughs> part of the reason why I sound like this. Now, Dad, don't you make me tell you again. Yes, that's right. He's literally like a dragon whisperer. <laughs> yes, dude. He starts. He's starting a revolution in this bitch. You, you guys go on ahead. Ah! I'll catch up with you. <laughs> she really She's so angry. Pissed. What the she fuck is? <laughs> Bro, you made toothless cum. I can make people cum with my fingers. <laughs> I can finger blast toothless. Don't say that. Like, why? <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? Look, look, look. Motherfucker, first guy to learn how to pet a dog, bro. Oh, I hate men. I hate men. She dyes her hair blue halfway through the movie. Feminism. Think about it. Pick up. Are you in there? Hi, Astrid. Hi, Astrid. Hi, Astrid. Hi, Astrid. Hi, Astrid. <laughs> I was about to say, if, if she had found out in that moment about Toothless, I would have felt like, wow, the movie is moving like way too fucking fast here. <laughs> like, this is a well written film. Exactly. Oh my god, I fucking love the theme to this movie. Oh it's my awesome. god. The music is so good. Can you imagine watching this in a theater? Like the sound quality Dude, and everything? Imagine. I can imagine it because I did happen, bro. Like, it's amazing. <laughs> Who's the most soy jack between us? I mean, your name is Jack. I think he's the more soy jack than me. Man, you're literally made out of soy. You were molded <laughs> by it. Two seconds. Holy shit. This is so fucking awesome. Oh my god. I just can't. Let's talk about that dragon oh no he found his bad dragon ship man it was a bit of a hiccup i'm sorry yeah i'm gonna start tap dancing will you tap tap dance with me right now jack you better be tap dancing me right now jack. we're white oh astrid that frame went hard as hell though the light bot yo that goes hard dude the zoom up to her was fucking insane Start talking. Uh, uh, Are you training I, I, with someone? I like how she's taller than him. Well, I think she literally has more muscles than him, so. Oh, yeah, he's a weak little twig. Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that? She's a friend. Astrid? Toothless. Toothless is fucking pissed. I'm telling mom. It's over, dude. It's over. She snitched. Hiccup's gotta take her out, man. <laughs> Oh my god. You're dead, bitch! He literally almost died flying like two days ago, and now this is his way of resolving the situation. He just like, the tree. Bro, her upper body strength is insane. Nothing to be afraid of. He doesn't like her, bro. Well, he doesn't want no competition. He's jealous, bro. What is wrong with you? Bad dragon! Bad dragon! <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Guys. I'm not even gonna cap. Like, this sudden change in air pressure do be making my lung collapse, though. They both fucking pass out from lack of oxygen. Oh my goodness, she's hugging him. Oh my god, it's so kawaii des. I mean, this is the ultimate way to impress a white woman, right? Like, I think he unlocked the cheat code. Yeah, so we just need to find a dragon. <laughs> no, he's literally just discovering the strategy. If you want to get the girl, just have a cute dog. Yeah, like, bring a dog to the park and, like, your chances go up 700%. <laughs> I admit it. I like your golden retriever, and you're okay, I guess, too. <laughs> Holy shit. I don't remember this part. Oh my god, it's the throat goat dragon. Is Hiccup gonna explain what the throat goat dragon does? <laughs> he gives mad head. Hiccup, we just discovered the dragon's nest. And you want to keep it a secret? Well, uh, to protect your pet dragon? Are you serious? Yes. Yo, that was a Sigma moment though. He said, I don't care if I can save millions of lives. I like my friends. Oh, ah! the scallop. No, fucking. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna tame it. He's gonna train it, dumbass. Have you read the fucking title of the movie? 
We don't have to kill them. We just have to f them. I said stop the fight! <laughs> bro, toothless nose! Toothless, toothless nose! nose! They got a mind melt connection, They have that bro. connection, man. No, Dad! Dad, he won't hurt you! Oh my god, Toothless <laughs> is gonna kill his dad. Toothless, stop! Jesus Christ, no! bro. No! No, they're beating no! his ass! No! They're beating his ass no! with the quote no! retweets! No! 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 They're beating his ass with the quote retweets! Toothless bought Twitter blue. Don't do it, man. Toothless, bro, you paid for Twitter, man. For once in your life, would you please just listen to me? You're not a Viking. You're a fucking poor hiccup. You're not my son. You're not my He straight up said I fucking disown you. Or maybe he was just being honest. You're adopted. 300 years, and I'm the first Viking who wouldn't kill a dragon. First to ride one, though. And first to ride me. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> Astrid, Astrid, what the <laughs> fuck did you say? I looked at him, and I saw myself. Dude, you're not black. You're not <laughs> black. That's not you. I think he's getting the pass, though. You're crazy. Bro, what? Oh All my the bitches God. love Hiccup, man. He's given the femboy, like, dream Minecraft SMP streamer vibes. Whoa. Oh my God. Is he gonna yell retreat? He is not retreating. They're fucking Vikings, man. They don't retreat. Vikings don't back down, bro. They're fucking awesome. Someone just said glory hole. Literally, because no, they're fighting not, for glory. That is not it's okay. a hole. If you want to make it to Valhalla, you gotta go to the glory hole. Every hole is a glory hole if you think about it. Baby! No, me! I love the design of this guy. He's so menacing. He's got the Christopher Walken hairdo, too. Like, it's so intimidating. Okay, left. Blind spot. Make some noise. Keep it Dude, Astra's just like chilling with her man, bro. Dude, I was about like, to say, like, the twins are on the two-headed one. The other two have their own dragon. And she is just like all up on his business right now. Like, what is what is going on here? Right Hiccup now? is her dragon. Yo, core, chill, man. <laughs> chill. That was Riz, though. That was Riz. How to Riz a dragon more like it. <laughs> 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 Dead. No! You gotta give Hiccup mouth to mouth, Hiccup. Kiss your son. Dead? Oh my god, his dad's gonna save him. Oh, he's so strong. And that's underwater, too. That makes it like three times as harder. <laughs> Fuck yeah. He's like an X Wing. <laughs> that's literally like Luke Skywalker destroying the Death Star touch. <laughs> Facts. He's killing the dragon. He just murdered the MF. Well, I don't think he trained that guy. The dragon exploded. That's fucking awesome. What? Thank you for saving my son. Well, you know, most of them. He lost an arm, a leg. He doesn't have a penis anymore. Um, you're in my house. He's literally a dog, bro. Look at this guy. <laughs> Look at him. Bro, damn. Dude, I remember this fucking broke my mind as a kid. I was like, what? <laughs> he fucking lost a leg? That's crazy. Because in kids' movies, no one fucking loses anything. There's no goddamn consequences. Yeah, I think I remember them saying they had to, like, fight for this. It represents both of them because they both lost. He lost a fin. Oh he lost a leg. God, they need right. each other. They're the same. Come on, guys. Get ready. Pull that tag. Yo, this movie's awesome, man. Remember what Eden said at the beginning, though? I almost want to take my headphones off. I hate this movie so far. That's for scaring me. Oh my goodness, here it comes. This way, this... <gasps> what, another one? Oh Two kisses in one Is that allowed? <laughs> That was a that was a good movie. That was a really good. That was a solid nine out of ten. The second movie looks so much better. You will be astounded. I'm confused. Don't we already know how to train a dragon? Why do we need a second one? It's because now they're gonna t how to teach your dragon pronouns. Okay, that's gonna be the new movie. Oh, it's the woke dragon arc. Yeah, dude, this movie, this shit got the Kung Fu Panda budget now. What the hell? Dude, this shit is beautiful, man. Like, <laughs> oh my god. The upgrade from one to two is unparalleled. Come on, Barf. Starting to stink around here. His name's Barf? That's their dragon. They named it Barf? It is. You are what you eat. Barf? <laughs> we can still win this thing. 
Oh yeah, oh yeah, he's a crippled now. He's disabled. Do they have like handicapped dragon parking spaces? Yeah, he's got to put a sticker on on uh, Toothless now because they're handicapped, right? Shit. This scene's awesome, bro. Do I remember watching this movie? Oh my god, this shit's peak. Oh my god. Is this Tears of the Kingdom, bro? Oh my- Dude, it's literally the beginning of Zelda, Zelda Tear of Kingdom. Oh my goodness, it's Tears of the Pe- Just- just call it con- bro. Like, Tears of the Pe- like, Zelda. Like, come on. Who sings this song? Is this like cold play? Like, this is like warm play or something. Like, this, like, <laughs> this is pretty good, man. I do be feeling kind of warm and like happy. This is big happy time moment. Happy. Dude, that's crazy. He has like a glider and he can fly. See, I love this. He's using the, the hot air from his explosions to lift him up. Oh, shit, dude. That's science, dude. Yes, yeah, science. Oh, oh, look how sexy he is. Holy shit. He's bad as hell, bro. Look, he's got the little braid too. Like he, why is he so bad? That's because he's become a Chad. He's that hot indie boy, bro. Oh my God. I'd let him play Wonderwall. In combat to the bitter. Oh! This is cute. That was, that was the scene. That was the scene where it looks like he's c***ing. <laughs> <laughs> There's like a frame there of him like looking back with his, with his face like, <laughs> Yo, there she is. I'm gonna say it here. He can do better. He can do better. Are there dragons gonna like have a thing with each other too? Is that what? Okay. Nah, that's a friend. That's a friend thing. Also, you understand like the mating process of the dragons or whatever? Yep. I've made it with many dragons, so I I know their I know their patterns. The sun shining, terrible terrors are singing on the rooftop. Am I wrong? He could do better. Am I wrong? Like what? how? Look at him, bro. Like he is a little golden goddess, and now he's dating Potato Head over here. Like it's not. Dude, she's way less Potato Head than the first movie. Like she literally looked like a fucking Nintendo me in the first movie with the balloon head, and now she has like a, a like a human shaped head now. Once a potato, always a potato. There is something out there. Elden Ring! Elden Ring! Are they gonna find the lonesome dung eater? Oh my god. He's not lonesome. He has plenty of friends. <laughs> He's loathsome. He's got a squad. He's got a squad. Wait, so who are these guys? Are they like poachers or some shit? They're dragon poachers. Are there like more than just like the, the Scandinavians or whatever? Like who are these guys? There's like rival tribes? Yeah, there's a whole, there's a whole world out there. What do good or... There are other dragon riders? Is this movie like a female gaze movie? Like, we get a lot of male gaze movies. It's like, are we seeing a hiccup through the female gaze? You see the little bit of stubble on his chin, you know what I mean? So my, when I gaze at hiccup, am I a female? I'm gazing at it. I've been gazing at him the whole time. He says we're going. Now. They all say that. Is he talking about the people he captures or his dates? That's what they all say. That's what every Tinder date says until I lock them in my basement. These guys. Or trappers. Dragon trappers. Dragon trappers. And the worst part is, it was drill. They were British rappers. Because Drago Podcast is a madman. And if he's built a dragon army, God's help us all. I'm sorry, but Draco Farthead is not intimidating whatsoever. You haven't seen him yet. I thought the last guy was Draco Fartface. No, he's just a lackey. Oh, okay. So Draco Farthead is like... The big bad guy. He's scary. Yeah, Draco Farthead is pretty scary. Pick up, don't. I have to. <laughs> See, this is from back in the the good old days when people were allowed to be straight in movies. Oh my. Well, she has the same chin as him. Ew, her chin. <laughs> her chin makes all the facial expressions like so much more unsettling. Take me. What the fuck? She said, take me. He's literally, he's got a chipmunk outfit, bro. That's a flying squirrel. He's a flying squirrel. He's got the Alvin and the chipmunks outfit on. Into her midst came a stranger from a strange land. Oh, this guy. This is Draco Farthead. Dude, he's Jay Schlatt. The dad is Jay Schlatt in the past. Did you see his fucking, out his fucking facial hair? Oh, come on, dad. Really? Who the fuck is that guy? Who is that? That's Queen Lord. That's King Queen. That's a uh, appears. King Queef. <laughs> King King Queef only appears at some points in the film. It's, a, it's like an Easter egg. You can't handle my gaseous. Yeah, this is not clouds, by the way. 
It's all a quick. It's all a quick. Oh, he impressed them because he he did the little trick where you like light your fart on fire, and they thought it was really cool. He put the lighter up to his ass. Like they're like, damn, that's impressive. Who is this guy? This guy's creepy, man. Is that a is that a person? No, it's a dra it's definitely dragon, right? No, it's King Queen. They move like a demon creature guy. Is this like a, a guy that was raised by dragons or something? It's Draco Bloodfist or whatever. That's yeah. not Draco. There's no blood on his fist, first of all. It, that he, It's not giving Draco either. What? Is that his mom? Dude, your genetics did not come from her. That's all I'm saying because she... <laughs> <laughs> She be looking insane, man. She a baddie. No, she's not. She has an alien head. She looks like a fucking Area 51 hybrid. But a mother never forgets. That's why he has a natural affinity to bonding with dragons. It's because his he's half alien. Mm. I don't have the words. These dragons are horny, bro. What the fuck? What the fuck? Mad horny. Toothless is the one girl showing up to the computer science class, bro. Like, <laughs> Jesus. Like, stop swarming her, bro. Jesus Christ. Stop! You'll only make it worse! It was a very unpopular opinion. Because you're a woman. This is just sad, because Hiccup was a man and he changed people's minds, but she's a woman. Oh, yeah. It's specifically because she was a woman that they didn't believe her. I rushed to protect you. The dragon liked the baby. It was a hungry dragon. And I, f I almost fed it to him because I like the dragon more than you. Ugly ass baby. But that baby's gonna be a sexy ass fucking guy in about 20 years, so thank God he didn't get eaten. Is, there's no weirder way you could have possibly put that. <laughs> this wasn't a vicious beast. That literally looks like a Pokemon. It looks like a Noivern Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, it does look like a Pokemon. That's why I like it so much. It looks like Noivern, which is a really cool Pokemon. Well, now I hate it, so thank you for ruining it. Fuck off, dude. Noivern's so cool. It broke my heart to stay away, but I believed it'd be safer if I did. She left her husband for a dragon. I would do the same. Not for a dragon. Look how many dragons there are. She could find a different dragon every night and be gone for years. The alpha species. Oh, she's with the Alpha. Your father was a beta hiccup. I'm with the Alpha now. Incredible. <gasps> well, not bad yourself. <gasps> oh, Riz. <laughs> no Riz. <laughs> no, that's his mom. Dude, it's the maternal Riz right here. Holy shit. The illegal Riz. <laughs> <laughs> the, illegal, the illegal Riz. What the flip? Do you see that fart bubble at the bottom? That's where Draco's fart comes from. Oh my god. <laughs> shit, dude, that was wet. That was liquidy, man. That shit was liquidy. Holy shit. Dude, this is like when you're in a fucking pool and you're, you think it has jets, but then the guy next to you gets out and then the jets stop. <laughs> dude, oh my god. Oh my god, he's fireproof. Dinkle Fart is fucking fireproof, dude. He's crazy. Dude, I can't wait till DreamWorks starts making shitty live-action versions of their movies and they get Jason Momoa to play this guy. Actually. We must attack Dragon Riders less than once. He's got that, like, 30-year smoker voice. Who do you think is gonna get him first, Hiccup or Lung Cancer? Isn't that the same thing, though? Because when you have... I think when you have Lung Cancer, you Hiccup more. So it's like, maybe Hiccup is going to kill him with the power of Lung Cancer. <laughs> Hiccup's gonna bring a pack of cigarettes for him. But did any of you listen? This is why I never married. This and one other reason. What, did, what does that mean? He's coping. Mean? He's clearly the uncle who's like 40 fucking years old and still is like never brought anyone. <laughs> he's got no riz. He has no riz. Wait, was he supposed to be gay? Was that implying that he's gay? <laughs> gay people can get married. What the fuck does that even mean, chat? What? I think he has no riz. It, it implies he has zero riz, not that he's gay. You're as beautiful as a day I lost you. You look just as much like a freakish alien as the day I lost you. Got that beautiful, bizarre bug eyes. He's got that, like, divorced Riz right there. He's got that his wife abandoned him 20 years ago, Riz, you know? He's learning. The British can change, guys. This made me change my mind on British people. You changed your mind on British people? Yeah? You're out of the channel. Go. Pack your, ba pack your bags. Oh, okay. All right. I'll pack my bags. Oh.
That's one of the hottest scenes I've ever occurred. This is an awkward fucking family dinner, dude. Like, can can the dad just hit the mom across the face? I think that would actually make it less awkward. With never a fear of drowning. She looks so uncomfortable. What is the expression? That's the expression when she abandoned her husband and son for 20 years and she feels guilt about it. And they come back into her life and she doesn't know how to emotionally take it. <laughs> my dearest one, my darling dear. This is the anti-divorce song. Chat, if your parents get a divorce because of you, just wait 20 years and maybe it'll get better. And throw this tune on. Show them this scene and the divorce will stop. Will you be my wife once again? We can be a family. What do you see? Yes. <laughs> oh, she can't? Doesn't she have like responsibilities in this like dragon sanctuary or whatever? She can bring all the dragons with her. And now it's about to be fucking destroyed anyways. This is 9-11 for dragons that we are watching right now. Keep hitting the mountain. We need to draw the alpha out. He wants to kill the alpha. Cause he's the alpha. Everybody else is just a beta cuck. We have a fight. How are they gonna win, bro? How, like, how? Oh, he just killed like 20 people. <laughs> I don't see how Dragon Fart wins this. Like, they haven't hyped up his army enough to, like, make me think that it even has a chance at beating this, like, primordial being of all dragons. <laughs> he is screaming like a madman. That is a horrifying scream. That's probably why his throat is so fucked up. Eden, you have to remember the fart foreshadowing. You you talked about that fart, and this is where it came from, man. He has his own primordial being? This shit just turned into a goddamn, like, Godzilla movie. This just turned into a kaiju battle. Another one? Wait, so if the white one is the alpha, does this one make it like the beta or is it like the virgin? Like, what is the, the, the dichotomy here? It's like Aiden Ross and Andrew Tate going head to head. Like someone has to be the new king. But they never wouldn't. Aiden Ross would just suck like Andrew Tate off until like he busted a million nuts. And, like, I don't know, man. L. Rip Bozo. Wow, they fucking suck at fighting. They didn't even last a few minutes, man. KO first round. There's the new alpha. All the dragons submit to the new alpha. Yes. Andrew Tate, my lord, what do you command? The check marks. The check marks are going to him. <laughs> All the verified users, bro. You see, I know what it is to live in fear. Wah, wah, trauma dumping. Wah, wah. Oh, I lost an arm, so I want to kill all the dragons. Boo hoo. You're a little kid, dude. Grow up, okay? You lose things in life, you got to move on, okay? He's a fellow amputee. Like, I feel like he should reconcile with Hiccup. For real, they should, like, kiss. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> fucking Christ! <laughs> <laughs> Whoever did the voice acting for his screams, like, I hope they were compensated properly because. There is permanent vocal cord damage. Toothless. No, don't give in to the brainwashing, Toothless. Don't pay $8 on Twitter, Toothless. You don't need the check mark. It doesn't do anything. It literally doesn't do anything. Don't buy it. Dad, no. Oh my God, his dad died. Oh my fucking God, his dad is dead. <sighs> He could still live. He doesn't look, he's all right. It's just a little bit of rocks. Think about it, he didn't even get the chance to pipe before he died. Even the fucking primordial beings like, shit, man, my bad. I'm out of here, too. Toothless didn't know what he did, bro. No, look at what he did. No, get away from him. Watching How to Train Your Dragon 2 <laughs> made us cry. Now you can use that in the title. He knows it's not his fault, but he's crying. May they sing your name with love and fury, so that we might hear it rise from the depths of Valhalla. Oh, they're giving him the Viking funeral. They're gonna light the boat on fire. What if he, like, aims a bone, he misses like five times? Hits a small child in the eye. Ah! Ah! A Viking barbecue! How, how do you become someone that great, that brave, that <laughs> selfless. <laughs> Shut up, Core. It's emotional. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I just wanted more material so you can put How to Train Your Dragon Made Us Cry in the title. If I watched this by myself, I would cry. But he took all the dragons? Not all of them. 
The baby dragons. They're taking the baby dragons. Child soldiers, child soldiers. You know, this shit went so well last time. Have you seen like the child crusade? That shit was perfect. Nothing went wrong. Hey, look, it's Hiccup. They're cheering. It's like six people on baby dragons. But you understand the theme of the movie's playing, so there's literally no fucking way they can lose. I'm just saying, if I was one of those Vikings and I saw six baby dragons come out, I'd be like, oh, we're fucked, aren't we? This is our health? Yeah, it's fucking over. This pupil is dilating like crazy. Do you see the optometrist recently? Guys, never give your dragon weed. That's actually step four of how to train your dragon. Don't pass them the blunt. Like, you might think it's funny, but like it actually fucks with their, their brain chemistry like so much. It's crazy how they can like summon the, the, the literal mother of all dragons, like the primordial being. But it's like, nah, just a, a dude and his fucking best friend dragon can absolutely clap booty cheeks way harder. Yo, what the fuck? He just, that was sick. That was so cool. With the fart sound effect there, editor. Reverb fart, thank you. I literally just laughed, Jack, just thinking about what that scene would look like with the reverb fart. That is how broken my sense of humor is. He unlocked his RAR XD form. RAR! You foreshadowed at the beginning of the recording that he would get his RAR XD abilities. No flicking way, man. I, it looks like I'm I'm watching a tower defense game right now. Dude, I'm playing Balloons Tower Defense. Oh my god, this is when you get the super monkey, bro. Always get the super monkeys. It's over for you, man. That last shot went crazy, bro. That was hard. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. Rip Bozo. So now Toothless is the alpha and Hiccup is the king. Dude, they both get their dub. But they also both caught a big L because like Hiccup's dad fucking got killed, so. You know, you get some dubs, you get some L's. Come here, you. <laughs> oh! Riz, Riz. Ow, 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 ow. Dude, that was hot, man, that was hot. That was hot as hell, bro. Granny liked that. <laughs> If the first movie was a 9 out of 10, this one was a 7, in my opinion. Damn, that's crazy, because I think this one's way better. I think it's way better. It's a light skin season? What did he say? It's a light, <laughs> light, light skin, skin season. season. Oh, I love the paintbrush. That's pretty. It's like, uh, what's that paintbrush guy? The paintbrush guy. <laughs> I love him. The, the afro Dude, that headass. That was fucking beautiful. Bob Ross. Oh my god, this is beautiful. Are you? <gasps> that's that's toothless. That's gotta be hiccup, bro. What? Man making a YouTuber face right there. Behold your worst nightmare. Behold. Along with his sister who insisted on coming. That's my intro. Sisted. Oh, Shut up. <laughs> Incested on. <laughs> Incested upon coming. Oh. <gasps> Astrid. Wait, that's a Astrid. Astrid, my Astrid wife. <laughs> <laughs> Easy, girl. It's okay. So, is Hiccup basically the underground railroad for dragons? <laughs> yeah, so basically. Like the, he's freeing the slaves. This is amazing. He's basically Harriet Tubman. That's what I was thinking. Like, who's better, Hiccup, Harriet Tubman? It's hard to say. Dude, this scene's pretty cool, actually. I, I wish I could see it, though. Well, it's because they put their render distance on Tiny. They have a really bad PC. They're trying their best to play Bed Wars with everyone else. Well, you see, because they, they're competitive players, so they want to maximize their frames. Oh my god, she's f***ing bad. Jack, she's invisible. We only saw her eyes. Toothless now has like a love interest. This is the best thing in my entire life. Oh my god. God, that there's a yeah, gorgeous looks screen great. right now. See what they do when they add sun to the movie? Like, it looks fucking gorgeous. I'm gonna put the sun inside your house and burn you alive if you keep talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> See how much you like it then. We could train a lot harder. For Sheesh, man. Sheesh. So am I allowed to say she's hot yet? Or do yes, I still have yes, to wait? Yes, yes, like, how... you can say it. You can say she's hot. Dude, she's hot. She's not hot. Dude, be quiet, bro. The adults are talking, Jack. Yeah, your mom's super impressed with me. I'm like the son she always wanted. Oh, she's <laughs> not just He's spank. trying to smash his mom. He's trying to become his stepdad, dude. You can call me Pop Sicka. The mom kind of bad, though. Chat, I've been saying the mom was bad since the no, last you movie. Weren't. Cut to the last video where you and Core were calling her an alien and I was calling her bad.
She be looking insane, man. She a baddie. No, she's not. She has an alien head. She looks like a fucking Area 51 hybrid. Chat, I've been saying the mom was bad since the last movie. You're a fucking bitch. Nine eleven for dragons. God Shut fucking up. damn it. Shut up! Just forget about that day! They say never forget. I am ready to forget. Watch this. Bro, every shot is so fucking dense. Holy cow. It literally feels like they just gave them like a billion dollars and said do whatever you want. That's a lot of boats. Like, they need a better parking system. <laughs> like, they need a parking structure. Bro, man. I would hate to get towed here. How go your plans to conquer the world? Ew, ew, what the fuck? Is this the Nicolas Cage character or something? He looks like a 3D render if they made Rick from Rick and Morty into a human being. Yeah, like those renders where they're like, what if a cartoon character were real and it's like the most fucking terrifying thing you've ever seen in your life? My job is chief to protect us, Hiccup. Then he throws Chuck's hiccup <laughs> in the fucking water to fend for himself. He fucking sneezes and drops him off the edge. Legends tell of ships that sailed too close to it, only to drop off the edge of the world. Oh, the edge of the world. Oh my goodness, he's a flat earther. Fuck yes. Well, this is when the world used to be cool or believed in a good flat earth, but now we believe it's fucking round or whatever. Even Night Furies? <laughs> Especially Night Furies. This scene is kind of weird because he's like a baby and he has this fucking American accent. <laughs> it's like, where did you learn to speak like that, you child? He watches Minecraft videos every day, bro. That's where he got his voice from. Hiccup was the first Canadian. But hey, if you're having doubts about yours truly, I'm pretty sure Snotlout's available. He only has eyes for your mom. Your mom. I feel like I'm getting c right now. <laughs> I'm just watching this absolutely perfect couple. They're too They're fucking too happy. happy. Get it away from me. I will never have this. I want Hiccup. I need him. Get away from him. Bridget or whatever your name is. It is crazy because it's like the perfect like couple because you would like <laughs> fuck everyone in the relationship, right? You, you'd fuck the guy, you'd fuck the girl, and you'd fuck their dog. He went too far this time. <laughs> Guys, he went too far this time. <laughs> Don't act like I'm not spitting. Back up, bro. <laughs> Dude, this is just Zekrom and, and Reshiram. What? Corey, you don't know Zekrom and Reshiram? Did you even have a childhood? What? Get back away! She's not giving you the eyes. Back away! You haven't hit yourself up with the axe body spray, man. She's gonna be disgusted. I love it. She's so glittery. She looks like a fucking cat. Looks like a naked mole rat. Would you, though? Stop asking Cor that question because the answer is always yes, okay? <laughs> What? What's gotten into you? What is all this slobbering and panting? Isn't it obvious? He's down bad, man. He's in heat, Hiccup. Oh, they're mate. That's the dance. That's the dance. Oh, Toothless has no game. That's why she ran away. But it's so sweet. I mean, look. That's so cute. This Oh, he's trying to riz. Man's about to be j off to his own shadow. He's doing the Patrick Bateman looking in the fucking mirror while he's Everyone's watching. I mean, everyone. You need to man up. Do as I do. Bro watched two Andrew Tate videos and he's trying to like encourage his friend <laughs> right now. I saw an important message on a TikTok. We've dealt with this kind before. Don't underestimate him, Hiccup. His face is very long. Mark my words, Hiccup. He's got chin for days. Do I say Chief Hiccup? Or do I call you Hiccup? I hate this fucking guy so much. He's easily become the most hated character. I hate him so <laughs> he's much. He's such a little dick. Ew, it has fucking acid. He's the most OP ass villain ever. Dude, what the hell? Yeah, so far, I think this is the most entertaining. There's a much more like personal feeling like between the villain and Hiccup. Mm -hmm. Bro took one L and moved the entire fucking civilization. The Night Fury escaped you again. I encouraged it. They've abandoned their only defensible position. I like this villain because I feel like he's the complete opposite of the villain of the last movie. Yeah. Like, he's just like a conniving bastard. Very soft-spoken. Yeah, I like him. What you picking up on, bud? The baddie, no. No, 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 the baddie. Bro, he smell that pussy from 10 miles away. She be stanking, bro. She does not want. <laughs> oh, hey, it's really nice to finally... Ah! Whoa! Homie or ho? You have to pick one. Dude, bros before ho 
Toothless Power. learned an important lesson today. But if you think about it, okay, like as far as we understand, they are literally the last two Night Furies. So in order to save their species, can you comprehend, comprehend how much incest that would require? Why do you, why? Why are you the way that you are? I'm just That's thinking about question. from like a conservationist perspective. Is like, Cora is the modern day Charles Darwin, okay? A little inbreeding never hurt anyone. Cora's off his, off his rocker today. I said make camp. Did you see them? Not build a new village who died and made you chief that was funny as fuck i should head back to make sure we weren't followed great idea i'll go with you for protection no 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 please that reaction is fucking so good hiccup could you please tell your friend i'm not gonna him. I mean, you know, I tried to do the same for years. Look how beautiful he is. Holy <laughs> shit. I like you don't even say he's sexy. You don't say he's hot. You say he's beautiful. He's fucking gorgeous, man. Oh my god. Let's just say this whole idea is very you. Let's just say I'm feeling 22. I look like Taylor Swift. That's an insult to Taylor Swift. That's an insult to Astrid. That's an insult to Astrid, okay? Astrid is way harder than Taylor Swift in this movie. And a better musician. Fucking trap. No, she isn't. Is, is Astrid making a song with Ice Spice? No. Well, Astrid didn't need Kanye West to make her career. She made Hic Hiccup made her career, bro. It's even worse. <laughs> He needs to learn how to hold it back, man. No one wants a desperate night fury. Look at look at that. Look, oh my god. Oh. He fumbled. He fumbled it. He fum fumbled the bag instantly. We watched the most L Riz How to Train Your Dragon movie. But he's got the goofy Riz though. He's got the goofy. Look at him. This, this is like I actually took notes from this movie. That's how I lost my virginity. Hiccup is literally like blocking right now like every single time things are going well and then hiccup shows up oh now he's trying to be a wingman literally by flapping <laughs> his wings he's being a good wingman now i take it back i take it back what are you doing you fucking bitch? you're waking her up it's fucking 9 a.m and he's down bad he's giving little bro energy bro like he's gonna show off his art skills look look at this look at this artists do get laid artists do get laid she likes it she's an art hoe all along she just loves art oh my god that's a terrible <laughs> picture shut up that's awesome but he gets pissed off when people fuck up his drawings she's got bpd bro she switched up in two seconds you see that shit i mean he is getting an art hoe so that would make sense she a baddie though it's worth it Oh yeah, he can't fly. Dude, 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 dude. He can't get it up. He can't, he can't get it get up. This is an allegory. This is an allegory. This is an allegory. It's an allegory. Oh no, he can't get it up. Oh, toothless. Bro. This is sad. This is relatable, this is man. She didn't even turn back. She didn't even turn back. Get Dragon Viagra for your Oh boy. my goodness. And now he's gonna invent Dragon Viagra. What are you making, Hiccup? Toothless can't get it up, Astrid. What? No, nothing. I'm I'm impressed. They're so married right now. Like True. they're so married. Oh, God, like, I, and I'm just looking at them have a perfect relationship, and I'm just here watching cartoons. Uh, he's fresh off his first date. Now he's love crazed. Love crazed, bro. <laughs> come on. That's one way to put it. They know what they wanted to say, bro. Like, come on. His mom's gonna fucking die. This is such a bad idea. Send one person back alone. Well, this wasn't what she said she would do. She said, I'm going to go look at the path that we took to make sure no one followed us. And then she deviated from that path and went directly to where they were. She deserved to die, yeah. He shouldn't trust no hoe. Do you kiss your mom with that mouth, Jack? Do you kiss mm -hmm. your mom on the mouth, Jack? <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> I want to touch those clouds. Holy shit. This movie's just fucking gorgeous. Like, I think right? I watched like five minutes of this movie and I said, ew, it's gray. I'm like, this movie's fucking awesome. There are people out there who are haters. If you hate this movie, you're a fucking asshole. If you hate this movie, you're scared of po- I'm gonna be honest. You're scared of po- You don't like women. You hate love. You hate fun. And you're homophobic. <laughs> She's like, I don't mind if you need Viagra. I still love you. Oh my Yo, god! Yo, that's fucking what awesome! What the fuck? So he can get it up. This should be a Viagra commercial. I don't know if you put <laughs> the bottom left corner, like the Viagra logo and like all the side effects. Side effects include vomiting, blood. Blood. Side effects include blood, bro. Just blood. <laughs> <laughs> You'll have blood now. Dude. Come on. Chin up, Hickey. Puff out that chest. 
Move that butt to the- He slapped his ass. He slapped his ass again. That's the second time he spanks him in this movie. <laughs> you can't call him Hickey also. You're not gonna give my boy Hiccup a Hickey. By going there to capture him. Capture him? I'm with him! Who else? Does he want to smash Hiccup? It really- I'm starting to feel some tension, dude. I'm not gonna lie. I really didn't see it that way the first time I watched it, but yeah. He just goes along with everything he says. He smacks him on the ass. He has a cute little nickname. You're kind of convincing me of this. Well, unlike you, when I was a boy and I came up on a night fury, I killed it where it slept. That simple act of courage made me a hero in my village. He's just been chasing the high he got when he was like 14 years old and people actually liked him for once in his life. He's anti-hiccup. He came across a dragon furry when he was a kid and killed it instead of befriended it. He didn't train it. Definitely the best villain. This is definitely the best villain. Take cover! Somebody needs to get these guys like some Kleenex. Like, that's a lot of snot. That's why they had so much budget for this movie is because they just got all the money from Big Pharma. You remember that like booger guy from the Mucinex commercials? Dude, the Mucinex oh, commercials yeah. were fucking awesome. I'm sorry. I love it. It's the like Mucinex ingrained in my brain. I love coming to the Corsa Cabana. Let's play it. Toothless and I will Toothless fly. Toothless has the light fury now. Toothless has a fucking girlfriend. What? You gave him his freedom, Hiccup. What were you expecting? Why is everyone just gaslighting him? Every single character is like, man, I'm sorry. Toothless is pussy with. There's no coming back from that. This is when your friend gets a girlfriend. They don't talk to you anymore. That's what this is about. Actually, you know, this movie is accurate. This movie's realistic as hell. The horns and everything, just like Barf and Belch. Except me and Barf can't stand Belch. So they're really just Barfs. It's warm in here. They're never going to pick her up. They're, just leave her. Take him and go. Please. I beg. She defeated the villain. With annoyance. Oh, she's voiced by Kristen Wiig, who is a Lola Bunny in a Looney Tunes show. She's just playing the same character. There's nothing but miles and miles of... The edge of the world! The Earth is flat! F*** you, globe tards! Wait, I gotta tell Reddit about this. Reddit has got to hear everything <laughs> about this. Um, you guys aren't gonna believe this. This is the Lily Pichu 5 gum ad. Chat, you're not gonna believe this. Chat, you are not going to believe this. This is what it feels like to eat 5 gum. I fucking hate that commercial, Jack. We're trying to turn this movie into a commercial. Holy shit, this movie's sick. Right? This movie is awesome. I love this one. This is so cool. This is so cool. It looks so much better than the other two. Man got the b and his entire people. He's literally king of the dragons right now. He's not a virgin anymore, bro. Look at him. He's, he's got that glow to him. But I don't like this movie anymore. Was that premarital? That's why Hiccup's sad right now, because Toothless had premarital stuff. Wifeless behavior. Son. This isn't wifeless behavior, son. Are you gonna get us a new mom? <laughs> son, look how fat I am. I don't think I can do better. Dude, you took Toothless away from his b That's just how the cookie crumbles, man. If she really loved him, she would follow. That's the way the coochie crumbles, bro. Yeah. Oh my god, the coochie followed. Yo, did anybody order coochie? Hey! Did anybody DoorDash some coochie? Shut the f <laughs> <laughs> Did any- <laughs> Were you followed? I never look back, Hiccup. Idiot. <laughs> idiot. <laughs> idiot. <laughs> Dude, hiccup. You fucking hiccup. Hiccup. You had to fucking bring Toothless out of his nice ass home. He was getting constant p on the reg. And now, what? look at what happens. Well, you're right. You're back to where you started. But I was the first to believe in you. He's got a supportive wife, man. This is fucked up, man. Unrealistic. Where's the gaslighting, man? Where's the trauma? Where's the spousal abuse? Dude, look at those hair blows in the wind, bro. He ain't gonna fuck you, Jack. Shut up. <laughs> Dude, did Hiccup even need a come, bro? He is taking a big L from Toothless right now. Like, this guy is about to die. <laughs> There's like Asterix and Obelix right now. What? Yet another what? <laughs> obscure reference for me and like five other people. Yo, comment down below if you understand what Thor <laughs> said. Fighting over a dragon? That's your plan? Save him. What? Hiccup dies. Play Tom Seuss or Cod. I know I've let you down. Can he let's he go to his leg. leg and there he goes. Oh my god, dude, fuck dude, you. Check off leg. Oh, oh my god. Fuck you, Russian. Oh, Stormfly. 
My good girl. Wait, are they giving up their dragons? Yeah, they're letting me go to the land of the dragons to be with their people. I didn't know he was gonna give away Toothless, bro. This is why you should never let your friends get girlfriends. This is what happens. This is what okay? happens. Never let your friends get girlfriends. <laughs> Sabotage their relationship at every possible opportunity. No, the dragons. Dude, that was really good. That was really... I would have definitely cried at that if you guys weren't fucking... Dude, you, you <laughs> are the most annoying person on the planet. You always make the most vile, inappropriate jokes. Yeah, but that was like an actual good scene. That was like a good scene. <laughs> it's like, but Shut this up. one time, Shut this scene up. was actually good. Oh my god, they're getting married. Aw, wholesome. Look at him. Okay, you win. I like sensitive guys. What? <laughs> Needless shipping at the very last second? They gotta, they gotta get a little bit of shipping bait in right before the end. There were dragons when I was a boy. Oh my god, he's got a kid! Oh, I love this scene. Yo! Oh my fucking god! He's so sexy, bro. Uh, I'm okay with that. Oh my god, he's got a little two Oh my god, Oh my fucking no god, they're so cute. No fucking way. Look, it's okay. Friends. W ending, man. Bro, this ending is so wholesome. Like, I don't want to say anything. This is so good. This is just genuinely no, it's like awesome. an amazing. Movie. I love it so much. This makes me so happy. Just like, just like growing up with this movie. These movies, I really like them. But I never saw the third one. It's like really great and wholesome and like Chungus and like Chungus and like it feels very good. And guys, if you guys want to, want, and if <laughs> you can, we have a bunch of other videos. Click on the screen now to watch some of the other ones and check out our Patreon for exclusive content. Thank you for watching. Alejandro Peredits, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kamalu, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, Diane Stolk, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Grenados, Gub Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Yoni Snail, Yonis, and Helio, I Pig, Brett Hand. Isaiah Alford, Kamui, Night VDB, Leaf, Lilac Moon, My Artistry, Master Nate, Matthew Byers, Solomon Graver, Native 5, Nick, Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Rain, Steven Sanchez, Sunny D, Tieran Sills, Toast, Ultimate Parson, Bell Explicit.